questions for coach and players? Uh, obviously, disappointed in the outcome. Uh, thought we dug ourselves a hole early in the first half. Um, we didn't come here to play a game. We came here to win a game, and we didn't do that. However, I'm very proud of the fight in our football team and uh, how they came out and played in the second half and, and made a game of it. Made some plays and uh, made it an interesting game. Just uh, didn't have enough, quite enough left at the end to pull it out. But I am uh, very proud of the leadership on this team. I'm proud of uh, uh, our coaching staff and I'm proud of all our players for really believing and, uh, and, and playing as hard as they could in that second half. And, uh, you know, it's a game of execution. It's a game of uh, mistakes. We had too many penalties today, uh, you know, too many turnovers in the first half. And you can't do that against a, a good football team like Michigan State and expect to win. So uh, really proud of the effort. We will go back home and we'll look at this tomorrow. We'll improve off of it. And uh, we're going to be a, a very good football team down the stretch here. If you have a question, uh, please just raise your hand and uh, they'll get your microphone. So we'll uh, open the question now. Coach, can you talk about your offense? It's, uh, it's been a struggle so far and what you guys need to do in order to start winning. I think we did a good job in the second half moving the ball. Um, had a few wrinkles in there. Uh, you, know, you play a defense like Michigan State, it's going to be tough to, to move the ball regardless of who you are, especially on the ground. Uh, they're ranked number one in the country for a reason. Uh, they're very good. So we knew this was going to be a tough, tough matchup. What we need to do is not commit penalties and, and turn the ball over. Coach saw uh, two trick plays. Was that kind of in the playbook coming into, coming into the game? Did you know you were going to roll those out? Yeah, we, we talked about that during the week. week. And if you uh, put the surprise onside kick in, there would you know, be three of them. Uh, you know, it, we thought it was important to you know get a spark, make some plays, and and uh, and really roll the dice a little bit. And uh, I thought we did, you know, thought we did a good job on all of those. We were three for three in those situations, so it's good. Coach, can you come in on the time of possession? The first half they had a two to one advantage. Second half that was a little more uh, even because you moved the ball a little bit and held on to it. But yeah, it comes wear you down a little bit defensively. Well, I mean, it comes down to moving the chains and you know. And keeping drives going, and so when you when you end up three and out, you don't use up much time on the clock. And so, yeah, the two go hand in hand. Um, you know, I think our defense has played well all year, uh, and they'll you know I continue they'll continue to get even better. So, uh, but I saw pro I've seen progress. You know, you guys may not see it, but I see progress, and uh, you know you're starting to see some young guys make some plays and. Uh, assert themselves. I think Tommy was a lot more comfortable in the second half uh, than he was in the first half. Um, made better throws. Uh, you know, again, it's a game of execution. You can, you can talk scheme all you want. You still have to block people. Uh, you still have to run. You have to throw. You have to catch on defense. You have to get off blocks. You have to make tackles. So, uh, you know, play calls, scheme, whatever. Uh, yeah, it's important, but you have to execute the fundamentals. You mentioned penalties, uh, Coach. Uh, a couple of them, uh, pass interference penalties, and Sean Bunting happened right in front of you. What did you think of those calls? I'm not going to come on, comment on any penalties or how the game was called uh, until I look at the film. On the uh, touchdown pass to Paul James, was that a way to, to keep him active in the offense or get more playmakers on the field or, uh, or underneath? All of the above. <laughs> yeah. Can you talk about uh, how you want to use the uh, whole gym going forward? I think you're, you're seeing it. You know, you're, you're seeing him uh, split out and then, um, you know, some in the backfield. So, uh, you know, we'll continue to build, build on that package. Questions for the players? Yeah, Tommy, you know, we talked a little bit throughout the week about preparing for this defense, and, and then you come out here and you actually play.